Hi guys and welcome to a new doll review video. Today I have with me Amy. So you've probably seen uh, me getting Ella from uh, AC BGD and like Alice collection and I got Ella with Amy's head and so I had the floating head of Amy and I really like like uh, she has a very cute face and so I was annoyed to have a floating head on my shelf so I decided to look for a body but uh, they are kind of limited so you can't get them anymore like it's very hard to get them like the only one for sale was the one the company like if someone decided not to uh, get theirs at the last minute so the company still have them so I couldn't manage to get a body alone so I decided okay I'm gonna grab the full set like she's not full set she's actually makeup Amy so I decided okay I'm gonna get the, the, that doll from Angelesque and she's white skin and I kind of thought mine was white skin but mine is actually normal skin so I ordered this one from Angelesque uh, it, it was still at Doll Chateau, so Angeles had to wait until Doll Chateau finished the holiday and asked them to send it to her and then they sent it to her and then she sent it to me. So basically the doll came from uh, China, went to the UK and then back to Japan and arrived at my home and she arrived, uh, I don't know if you remember before, like last time I had a doll like from... Uh, Alice collection the box was in very terrible condition but this one went from China to UK and came back and the ball the, the box is like pristine condition no problem whatsoever uh, really really nice and it's really strange because Alice collection put the box in a box and it got smashed and this one was put like they had one wrap of bubble wrap around and then a plastic bag and she blacks that and it still arrived like in this very awesome condition so I think if you have problem with boxes it has to be from the Chinese um, carrier because from UK to Japan in that box in a plastic bag and bubble wrap no problem at all so anyway, um, this one is Amy, so Amy is the one with a silly smile and my plan was to actually put my head on this body and sell this head but I'm gonna keep all of it because the skin tone doesn't match, so she's a white skin tone so it's, she's really pale compared to the other one and the face up is also different, she has the exact same face up as my Ella so I kind of like, oh, I like my other head, so I don't want to sell it because the other one is more special, she has a different face up. But I cannot sell this one and put the other head on it because the body color doesn't match and that drives me nuts. So anyway, I'm going to zoom on her and show her through from close up. So this is my new little Amy and she is super cute as you can see. So she has a uh, arm. Um, She's an aunt with those antlers, horns, antennas? I don't know what you want to call that. So it's magnetic and stay on her head like that and it can like move in every direction you want, obviously. She has those little pointy ears which are pretty cute. And she has this uh, face up which is the same as my Ella. So they look kind of like twins but this one is like the anemic twin of the two because her skin is so very very pale so let's zoom a little bit more on her face so you can see the face up from close up so as you can see she has a small little rise eyebrows on each side it's very small and she has the orange look all around her eye which makes them kind of deeper and she has this line over her eyes in brown and she has all those little eyelashes in different color at the bottom. So you have like brown little eyelashes and white little eyelashes from time to time. And then she has cute little lips around that teeth. You can see the teeth uh, in the center of her mouth. So no teeth going down like Ella's. So this is pretty cute little 
little aunt. So she is wearing actually a um, little fairy outfit, so uh, as an outfit for Pico Nemo. So I, I kind of like that she can wear my little fairy outfit because since I have so many of those outfits, it's really nice to dress her up. So she has like full articles, like she can move her head, obviously. La 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 la. Up, down, turn. Then she has full articulation at the shoulder. She has a double joint at the elbow so she can fold her arms fully like that. So it's, it's a pretty cool. Like it's so thin so I'm so afraid of breaking her because it's very very thin. And she has like articulation at her hand a little bit with the crochet. She has four legs and what I really liked in the face of that she actually had the red body blush so her legs, the tip of her legs, her feet basically are red and she has articulation here so you can turn her legs around a lot making them down having them up so it's just like full rotation you can extend them a little bit if you do like this and you can also extend the leg but you have to rotate and put it in the wrong direction because you have those little spikes on the knee which doesn't allow you to actually bend them uh, in this direction so you just stay in this direction mostly you can rotate it fully so <laughs> it looks a little bit funky but that's basically the knee being upside down so you don't really want that and then she has rotation here, but just rotation, uh, you don't have any join, it's just a ball as a sort of ankle, I guess, so you can only have the rotation. And then she also has this uh, ball here, so for the abdomen, and she is the diamond of the group. So I have the spade and the diamond now, uh, Ella is a spade. So it's pointy and you have the little orange dot as a tip. Okay. So I think I think she's really cute. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to probably try and modify a little fairy body for my other head and make her a butterfly. So I'll have like two Hella's head and the hand and hopefully I can make a butterfly out of the other one. But I think it's, I think she's really, really cute and I kind of like to have two aunts because that way Ella is not lonely anymore and she can have friends and they can do like cute aunt stuff together like go on the bananas and that type of things, stole my candies, so here we go. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, let me know what you think in the comment section below and to leave me a thumb up and to subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. Uh, this is my second end and I don't know if I'm going to get the full uh, cross. So there was like four, so I'm still missing Essa, which is with the heart shape, and uh, Echo, which is um, Clover. But the thing is they are hard to find and I kind of want them with the paint already uh, because... Like, if, if they can have the, the shape on the abdomen and stuff, I mean, I could probably do that too, but uh, I kind of like the company face up, so yeah, it's kind of hard to find. So, I don't know if I'm ever gonna get the two other, uh, if I find them at a good price, I might, but I'm kind of happy to, ha to actually have two of them instead of one and a floating head. Because even if I can exchange the head, uh, as I did before on some picture you might have seen, uh, I still kind of like to have the two hands next to each other. It's kind of very, very cute. So it's pretty nice to have two of them. Anyway, guys, uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. See you next time for something else. And after whatever you do, bye!